So we'll get back to some more Persona 3 Reload, where last time we took down the reversed fortune and strength arcanas, but at the cost of losing one of our own, thanks to, well, Strega. Yeah, that's, uh, it's very few and far between that we ever get to lose party members, and, uh, well, this one was just tragic. And this time, let's go, uh, well, I guess see what our future holds for us. One thing I want to mention before starting everything off, though, is, um, with the fortune, well, the reverse fortune shadow, I mentioned something about right before it died that it spun the wheel on death and it had appeared to do nothing. I want to mention that that is hinting towards Shinjiro's death that night. A lot of people miss that, and when I discovered that myself, I'm like, that is dark. That is extremely dark, but when you look back on it, it's one of those things that when you replay through the game, it's like, holy crap, that that's what it was referring to. Because in the original game, that was just a mechanic that it could just wipe you whenever it wanted. In this game, it was, uh, well, telling you that Shinjiro was going to die. Or somebody was going to die tonight. So, I wanted to briefly mention that because that is a missed component, and I think it's important. You got anything to say, Yukari? Hey, so... Nowhere else to go, huh? Fuka's right. I should have considered his feelings. I wonder what he's doing now. This is just a shitty situation for everybody. Right. Akihiko's right. Amada must decide what is best for himself. It is a difficult decision for a young person to make, but I'm not worried. Amada has a strong will. Hmm. I am confident he will make the right choice. He's also extremely, uh, good, or er, what, well, extremely mature for a kid. <sighs> I'm the worst. I lost my temper and snapped at Yukari-chan. I think it's just I'm really worried about Amada-kun. I know what it feels like not having a place to belong. Yeah. I speculate. My functions cannot address any highly metaphysical issues. As I am unlikely to be of any assistance, I will stand by until further notice. We've really got to get you trained on human emotions, because, uh, yeah, everybody needs... <laughs> everybody kind of needs a consolation right now. So... Aragaki-san uh, Aragaki was such a badass. All the way to the very end. You know... But he was all like, this is how it should be. His last words just keep echoing in my head. Uh, Do you think yours would leave that kind of imp impact too? <laughs> yours could too. Yeah. <laughs> no way, dude. I don't have the balls to say something like that. You never know until the end, man. And Akihiko's nowhere to be seen along with Ken. For some reason we can go out though. And uh, I guess to distract ourselves with uh, killing the previous night, we have our plants! Shinjiro, oh my god. Shinjiro's soul may have been gone, gone on, but his spinach is still here. Uh, and yeah, we're just gonna plant more spinach. We can, I mean, come on, man. Spinach is so good in this game. Really learned a lot from Popeye. So yeah, that's what I was referring to with the whole auto heat riser on Shinjiro thing. It was completely pointless because, uh, well, he was dead the next day and we couldn't even get to use him. <sighs> I feel really bad. I, I actually really like Shinjiro's character and I wish there was a way to save him. There is no way to save him in this game. In Portable there is on the female route, but yeah, no, that's not going to be covered because this is not Portable. This is Reload. So before anything else, this is something important you want to do. Go to Shinjiro's room. The door doesn't seem to be locked. We can go into his room. Literally already got cleaned out. He doesn't really have anything for us to steal, but check his desk. It's a simple desk. On the desk is a cardboard box. Arakaki's belongings are inside the box. Anything you put on him and anything he had carried will be given to you. They also give you Blade of Fairy for some reason. The desk drawer is slightly ajar. Open it. I found a familiar looking envelope inside the drawer. Inside the envelope was a single piece of paper. It's a document with the following written on it. Reinstatement form, Mr. Principal, Gakokan High School. It appears to be the school reinstatement form Mitsuru asked for, uh, me to give to him. 
The date and reason are blank, but there is a signature that looks like Aragaki's handwriting. Mm -hmm. Is someone there? Oh, it's you. Sorry for surprising you. I, I had a feeling someone was in here, so I came to check. What's that? <gasps> Did you find this? It was in this desk. I see. He made a habit of not leaving behind any personal belongings. But <sighs> I have no idea when he filled out this form to return to school, or whether he even planned to hand it in. But I think this is proof that he was thinking about the promise we made. I don't know how it accidentally muted my mic. I'm sure it is. Yes. He was so against it, and yet he still left this for us. I should show Akihiko. Or, actually, maybe I shouldn't. He probably wouldn't approve. Let's just keep this between us for now. Good idea. It sounds like you know how to handle those two now. Thanks to you, I was able to understand how he really felt. I'll say this on behalf of all three of us. Thank you so much. Here. You take this. It should go to you, since you're the one who got him to open up. In complete form. Someday, once we leave the storm, then, I'll tell Akihiko. I'll tell him about his struggle returning to this room to fulfill the promise we made. But he never forgot those days when it was just the three of us. Not even for a moment. And we can now fuse Hellbiker, Hooligan of the Underworld. That is the full set for Shinjiro's, well, social link episode things and yeah it's it's really sad <laughs> at least you get all this stuff before uh well losing it all i guess well you should hold on to that i'm sure that's what he would have wanted to you can hang out in here as long as you want but uh once you leave we will uh yeah we'll leave this <laughs> is there's nothing in here anyways i don't think you can re-enter only memories remain. So, I want to check. Uh, that Blade of Fury, I believe. Yeah, it just gives you Blade of Fury. Which, I think you get that regardless. You also get all of his other stuff if you want it. Uh, I mean... I, I say if you want it. You even get his uniform and all that stuff, but... Here's something, Dark. Can I give you... Oh, I never checked that. I can give you the coat. Oh, that's... That, no. No. That's just... No, I'm not gonna be an asshole. Jesus. Yeah, your best friend just died. Here, take his sh take his coat. Oh, God, that's that's really dark. Um, Actually, I want that on you. Uh, Sure, warning shoes. You can take the slash evasion. And you can take the floaty sandals. Sure. Oh, God, I can give you his boots. It's They're better, too. Fine. You know what, kid? Even though you're technically not in the party, take the dead man's shoes. God, that's dark. <sighs> so yeah, you don't lose out on everything if you do end up, um, well, once he does die, you get everything back. So that's mostly because of New Game Plus stuff, but yeah. It seems like we can go outside too, which if I'm able to, I can. I want to make a quick visit to the Velvet Room. Because we need some personas. Um really quickly we don't need hanged but we we basically need 10 slots so and we have 12 in total we have okay we don't need emperor so i can get rid of you we need we need sun we need strength we don't need fool but i'm gonna keep you we need chariots i'll see about keeping hanged if i can because what is it one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve okay yeah so we can do that okay Really quickly, I'm going to go grab some personas, and I'll meet you guys back on out here very quickly.
back out here, I have got the personas that we need. Now, this is mostly for the entirety of the month of October, so the, persona, uh, the personas you will need are Magician, I have an Akomata for this case, er, yeah, that's Magician, I'm, I thought that was Hyro for some reason. We'll need Priestess, Hierophant, Lovers, uh, if you haven't finished Chihiro's thing, you'll need Justice, but I mean, we already finished her thing, so it doesn't matter. Fortune, Strength, which is up here, Temperance, Star, and Sun. The other two are Hanged and Fool that I have personally because, well, they're really good personas. So, there you go. Back to the dorm. God, everything's just going to be depressing for here uh, from here on out because, uh... Uh, Shinjiro stuff. Oh, you have new stuff to say. You have my thanks. I apologize for all the trouble, but please accept my thanks all the same. I want you to know that I fully intend to do all I can to honor his memory. I mean, yeah, you were basically his best friend. You guys were the big three. And really, the big three for us was, uh, well, myself, Junpei, and Yukari, but, you know, I guess it doesn't really matter. This is not UA. Anyways, for tonight, uh, we gotta console the dog. <laughs> He seems happy, though. Let's, uh, go to a walk. As usual, I observe no abnormalities in Koromaru-san's physical or mental status today. Hmm. May I have a moment of your time? There is something I wish to speak with you about. I was performing research today and came across a puzzling piece of information. It stated that there is a specific time of year in which one can reunite with the dead. It appears as though spirits return to the living realm during this time. What exactly does this mean? Once an organism comes to the end of its lifespan, its physical body will deteriorate. But does this mean that there is a spirit that exists independent of one's physical form? And in that case, would that mean that Aragaki-san is... Welcome back, Koromaru-san. Hmm? What are you holding? Luck incense. Uh, nobody was lucky. Ugh. It appears as though he wishes us to have it. Why don't we gratefully accept? Now, let's return to the dorm, shall we? Class has ended, and nobody wants to talk- Man, not even Yukari or Junpei are here. Yeesh. I have a theory. It is unfortunate, but not many students appear to be saddened by Aragaki-san's death. Apparently, human relationships are quickly forgotten, though our case is exceptional. Yeah, you guys are assholes. I'm sorry. Like, Jesus. I never really had- Thankfully, there was no major things that happened when I was going to high school. Although, as, uh, as soon as I left high school, bad things started happening. I don't know why, but uh, I'm just glad to avoid that when I did. So, just... Anyways, for right now... Uh, I think Elizabeth actually has something for us. Uh, yep, she has to eat like a what? Uh, anyways. We're going to Polonia because we gotta get some requests from Elizabeth. Uh, we apparently have some finished, too. Hi. About requests. Are you accepting a request? Whoa, glasses wipe. Marvelous. Glasses. An object that makes you feel infinitely more intelligent when you don them. I wish that was the case. I wear glasses every day, lady. There is even an item that helps maintain the pristine quality of the lenses. I believe it is called a glasses wipe. While such an item is not necessary for those who do not wear glasses, it is essential for those who must. I would love to get my hands on this glasses wipe. Would you bring one to me? I will await uh, yeah, I just use my success. shirt for the most part. I'm very lazy. Bring a helm from the Sengoku era? If I may say so. For this request, I would like you to bring me a certain headgear. More specifically, this headgear is a helm that has existed since, uh, since ancient times. Since this is an item rich with history, I expect it will provide the wearer with quality defense. I believe you may be acquainted with someone who cherishes one such helm deeply. I will await uh, we're gonna success. maybe have to steal that from him. You want to have sushi? If I may say so. Ever since the time we went around sampling your world's culinary uh, delights, I, my interest in food has been piqued. In my quest for more delicacies, I came across information about this sushi. 
I learned that it is eaten during festivities and off even uh, often yeah, often offered to the gods at their shrines. This sushi must taste divine, especially if it is the gods' favorite food. I wish to have a bite myself. By all means. Sushi is so good, man. I freaking love Sushi is definitely an acquired taste, at least from my experience. When I first like uh, tried it, I'm like, eh, it's okay. Then the next time I liked it more, and now I wish to, <laughs> I, I, I wish I could have sushi every day. I, I love sushi. Mikazushi Budi Chika, Mun, uh, Munai Chika, Old Document 7. Yeah, we still need to make these personas. I think uh, this one we probably can work on making. Oh, next time we go into Tartarus, I'll see if we can make uh, Titania. And Rongda is really good too. Okay, so we'll have to work on those. Very well. And Glasses Wipe. Uh, who has that? It's not anybody at school, I don't think. Does it say on the request, actually? Uh, Glasses Wipe. Should be uh, anyone who wears glass. Ch Chihiro? Chihiro's like the only one that wears glasses, right? Uh, I guess we'll worry about that later. It doesn't really matter too much. I, it might be somebody at the dorm, though, but I don't think anybody wears glasses at the dorm. Yeah, no, I don't think anybody does. Eh, whatever. So for tonight, uh, or today, actually, uh. Yeah, we're doing something weird. Will you? Yeah, okay. We're going to Naganaki Shrine. For we are pulling a fortune for Yuko because we need points. So, draw a fortune. We will think about uh, team manager. There you are. We will think of Yuko for some reason. Draw a fortune. Draw my fortune to help deepen your bond. Blessings to the believer. Yeah. No. <laughs> well, I got 500 yen at least. I didn't lose money. Hello, this is Elizabeth speaking. I'm calling in regard to a recent change in Tartarus. It seems that a path that had been blocked oh, really? is now open. I thought it prudent to inform you. Well then, I wish you a safe journey. This one required a sacrifice in this case. Jesus. We're not going to Tartarus anytime soon, thankfully. You look half dead. What are you doing out here? When Mom died protecting me, no one believed the truth. To this day... They say she died in an accident. It didn't even happen. That's why I wanted to clear the record. I thought that's what she would have wanted. Maybe then she'd finally be at peace. They said he died in some violent crime, right? No one knows the truth. Just like with Mom. And now, I'm going to be left behind. Just like always. The dead are never coming back. You have to accept that. But you still have your life. <sighs> I'm not here to bring you back. You can waste away here if that's what you want. But if you still have the will to fight, then come back and stand on your own two feet. I know that. I've known it all along. I've just been lying to myself. I needed something to hate. To keep myself going. I couldn't face the thought of being alone. But that's exactly what happened. All this time, I've just been running away. <laughs> running away anymore. I swear it. Aragaki-san, I'll see this through to the end. The resolution of Mata's heart has awakened a new persona. Amada's persona nemesis has given rise to Kala Nemi.
and a new Theurgy. One based on support, revives party, restores HP, and reflects attacks for everyone. What the hell, man? Goodbye, Mom. I'll be okay now. It's already been a day. Yes. It has. So, where's Sonata-san? He said to leave Amada-kun alone, but... Maybe we should look for him. What do you think? Give him time. So you agree with Akihiko, then? I can't just sit here! I'm going right now to... Amadakun! Oh, thank goodness. I was so worried. You were? Amado, will you continue to fight? Yes. I'm done running away. That okay with you? Positive. It's all right. We can trust him. Please, don't scare us like that, okay? All right. I'll go and talk to the chairman. You should get some rest. Okay. Well, at least he's sort of back on the team. Uh, sub Junpei. Hey, not bad. He's a lot tougher than I thought, dude. I'd be so depressed for like three whole days, maybe. Or even a week. But he bounced back in just one day? Jeez, that kid's nuts. He's a lot more mature than we realize. All right. It seems I appraised him accurately. He has the soul of a warrior. I admire, I admire his fortitude. Probably got that from Aragaki. That is a bookshelf. Is that I have confirmed the metamorphosis of two personas, most likely the result of Aragaki-san's death. There may be more changes to come, so I will remain in observation mode. Observation mode? Um, hey, you're supposed to be resting, buddy. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry about what happened. You could have told me, uh, called me, yeah, could have told me no, but you let me come back. I'll make it up to everyone, to Aragaki-san too. So we have another new persona, which is on Ken. And personally, I kind of wish he kept the other one. I love how Nemesis looks. Kala Nemi, I mean, it's cool, but man, it's just chunky. I don't know. It just, to me, it doesn't really fit, but I like its design. It's cool. Kalanemi, who now completely nullifies light and is only weak to dark. That is not the button I wanted to press. A Hindu goddess whose name means Edge of the Wheel of Time. The wheel refers to Samsara, the cycle of death and rebirth, meaning she is a goddess who has transcended life herself. Again, I still love the attention to detail that, at least for my knowledge between Persona 3, 4, and 5, that Ken is the only one who has a female persona and most personas attached to people are gender equated. You know, like male personas on male party members and female to female, such like that. So I, I do like the mix up that Ken has primarily female personas because, you know, he's just a little kid. So who, who say, who's to say he can't just identify with female personas? It's cool. And uh, his theurgy is so overpowered. I'll talk more about the two theurgies, but we're eventually going to have more and more people have two theurgies instead of one. It's kind of like Koromaru's situation. We can use both. So, I never really talked about Akihiko's as well. Uh, where are you, buddy? There you are. Nope, that's Mitsuru. So, Electric Onslaught basically is a severe elect damage to one instead of to all with Heavy. It's really good. It's really freaking good. So, there's that. Nice Persona Evolutions. Uh, for tonight, uh, first of all, I want to check. We have not visited the weird URL guy in a long time. He probably has new stuff for us. Uh, veggie blog site. Note with the URL of a blog written by devoted vegetable garden lovers. Okay. Because <laughs> we have not used the computer in a long time. So tonight we are. Shared computer. 
Uh, we want the, I guess the veggie blog. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, dorm, I mean, it just says veggie farmer sim. So I guess, well, I don't know, actually. I think this is what it is. Either that or it's from a different thing? I don't think it's open during the day, though. Ah, screw it, we'll do it. Is this, because that's the only veggie thing I see. Let's see what this URL leads to. My lovely veggie garden blog. Bloggers seem to express their love by writing entirely in baby talk. What? Hello, hap I hate this. It's so pretty and very rare. I hate this. Golden tomato sprouts are only available at certain flower shops. Those are really good. We will buy those as soon as humanly possible. pretty chilly tonight. Can you believe it's already autumn? It'll be winter before you know it. You look a little tired. Did something happen? I lost a friend. Oh, you did? In this world, people die every day. Until recently, I thought that was as normal as the changing of the seasons. But now... I understand why people mourn. For the first time, I have a friend. Lately, I've been remembering things more clearly. You recall the end I've spoken of? Some were calling it the fall as well. It's drawing closer each night. Can't you feel it? You and I are like kindred spirits. So, I wonder why I'm the only one who remembers. This is tearing me up. Could it be that you can't accept me for who I am? What? Still creepy as hell, and for being the Death Arcana, you would think you would know about death. I'm sorry if I wasn't making any sense today. Maybe it's the change of season, but we're still friends. That will never change. Well, I'll be going for now. Good night. Where do you run off to? Back to school. No time for morning. Um, hey. Midterms start next Tuesday. Math is killing me. S uh, sine, cosine, tangent. Sine, cosine, tan, uh, t uh, I hate this, uh, whoa. Sine, cosmos, cosmos, sin, tan, sin, cos, cos, sin, cos, cos, sin, sin. Huh? What the heck? What kind of spell are you chanting? The terms start next Tuesday. Cosmos, sin, tan, what? Okay. I barely remember, I think that's, uh, not calculus, out. what the crap is it called? Uh, oh god, what are you talking about? Question to help you m motivated. Uh, that would be dopamine. Melatonin puts you to sleep. I don't know what the hell histamine is. There's a confirmation. Correct. What the hell is that? Uh, sign cotine. There's a word for like with the category that it goes into. Because it's not. I mean, I, a calculus does use that, but I can't remember what the crap. Not algebra. Is it algebra? I don't know. As I said, when I took calculus in college, my entire like skill of being good at math went down the drain. It was bad. I hated calculus. Uh, for one thing, I'm gonna go and check on something. So, the thing I did, uh, you look like Maiko. Okay, anyways. The thing I was going to do last night, uh, was the wrong thing, technically. Um, I wanna go in here. It's not a big deal. It's not gonna break or anything. So you should have... Yeah, there you go. I never bought it. Okay, I should have went back here and bought this stuff. Uh, so, there'll be another time where we go and, well, check these out. So, actually, soon we'll be going to use the computer again, so we'll just do it for that night. It's not that big a deal. As for that, I want to go and check on those tomato sprout things, because golden tomatoes are really overpowered. 
So let's see if you sell them right now. Uh, golden tomato sprouts. Uh, oh, you're the one who put up on the blog. Golden tomato sprouts. Um, uh, I am not buying <laughs> buying 99 of them. I will buy at least 10. They are really good. They are a really good recovery item. We'll grow those at a certain point later. So, for tonight, uh, we're actually hanging out with somebody we haven't hung out in a long time. Hung out with in a long time. Which is Hayase. We have not hung out with you in a very long time, buddy. What's up? What's up? Let's get a bite. Yeah. Sorry, I kept you waiting. Uh, are you okay? Yeah, sorry, I guess I need to train more. Whew. It's going. I'm super thirsty. Oh, that was great. I always say food tastes better with a buddy. I used to come here all the time with my teammates, but... Uh, well, I'll come back here with you. We're the only one who says that anymore. Anyway, they wouldn't come now even if I invited them. I don't really get along with people who don't take the sport seriously. Even started training at different times. Nothing's organized anymore. I used to love it there, you know? I spent all my time on the track, practicing and training. We all loved track and had so much fun together. But then... Ah, never mind. It doesn't matter. We're too different, them and me. I'm going to reach heights they never will. I have to. Passion is a good thing, but... You know, you also have to have fun with it. Not just a job. Sorry, that that was a weird conversation. I think I'll do lunges the whole way home. You keep at it too. No slowing down. I now realize the glasses thing. It's you. I forgot that technically you're part of the team, even though you just overlook everything. Huh? Hmm? Need something to wipe off your glasses? I do have something, of course, but you don't wear glasses. Well, if you're looking for a wipe for eyeglasses, I have a spare. Goodbye. Hang on. Here, it looks stingy, but it, looks, it works very well, in fact. Okay. Oh, and here's a little something extra. Gag glasses. It's the secret item I was thinking of surprising Aragaki-kun with the next time I saw him. Surely this would be that uh, this would get that stoic face off of a bit of his to break into laughter. Er, uh, well, that was the plan. <laughs> Why don't you take it? I'd be happy if you could put it to good use. Good use, huh? And yeah, man, that really <laughs> that went downhill real quick on that end. Sheesh. All right, Good Elizabeth, I brought you some glasses for some Here reason. Are my re Let's hear the result. So this must be the sort of thing one would use to clean a, a pair of uh, you know, eyeglasses. Fine microfibers, maximum flexibility and absorbency, and an ideal size. It's utterly perfect. Of course. I see. It wasn't just any old rag after all. Hmm? You've brought something else with you. May I see that as well? Oh, no. Oh, my. What elegance. Though resembling of my master, th this does leave a different impression. Then, oh, let us God. Go. Uh, well, thank God Yukiko <laughs> isn't here. Not only does it give me a semblance of intelligence, but one of harmony as well. What a splendid item. Please take this as a reward. Garnet. That was it. That was it? What the hell? I mean, I guess I didn't really do much, huh? So, uh, back to the dorm. <laughs> Uh, go and chat with everybody. Do you have some time? I believe Kurijo Kun told you all about the tragedy that befell Amadu Kun's family. It happened after dealing with the irregular shadow, after the dawn of the dark hour. Amadu Kun probably didn't have any idea what was happening at the time. Amadu Kun and Aragaki Kun. 
I knew what was going on between them. I never expected it to turn into such a horrible tragedy. We shall pray for Aragaki-kun's er, happiness in the next world. The next world. And if you knew something, why didn't you step in, man? Excuse me. Karamaru-san says he's in good spirits. If anything, he seems to greatly res uh, respect Aragaki-san. Yeah. <laughs> he gave his life to save another. How noble. I'd like to think I could do the same if it came down to it. How about you? Sure, why not? Why Why can't I have a serious answer here? Uh, sure, why not? <laughs> That's an interesting response. Though I suppose I quite, uh, I suppose quite admirable as well. I think we'd be the self-serving type. Or, well, serving of others. Um... Uh, yeah, I just want to talk. He was just... Why are you crying? I knew there was always this risk, but... Sorry, I... I'm still a little shaken up. I can't think straight. Sorry, jeez. I thought we were all good. I think... I said my prayers, so... I'll be okay. Grieving over a death and just feeling down are two completely different emotions. So, yeah. I'm okay. You are a tough kid. Give me a break. Ugh. Nothing that lasts forever, huh? Shinji was satisfied. He got out while he was still ahead. Let him rest in peace. We should be focusing on what we need to do now. There's less than a week until midterms. Sounds like you got your head in the game a little bit. Nah. I know, I know, I should be studying. I just can't concentrate. We lost so much, man. <coughs> Why, aragaki son? Seems like everybody had a big hit. There's no way I can study right now. Not when a close friend just died. I can't just forget about it and move on. I just can't do that. Jeez, uh, I thought everybody was going to be like this yesterday. Why is it today everybody's just super depressed? It's, it's been two days, three days since he died. I mean, it's still sad. Yeah, it's still very sad. Last thing for tonight is the computer. I'm gonna do the thing I was supposed to do the other night. I was supposed to do this, but um, it's fine. It's not, you know, we flip it around a little bit. Veggie Farmer Sim. Looks like a game that simulates raising crops. We're literally just playing Stardew Valley, I guess. I was able to produce a bountiful harvest. I feel like I learned something tangible about growing uh, vegetables. Uh, now we can increase the amount of crops. That's very nice indeed. Another day is ended. Well, started, I guess. Uh, what do you have to say, Junpei? So, so I... n n no one's talking about Aragaki-san anymore, now that we have exams. I guess people just worry about their own problems, huh? Kind of sad, don't you think? I mean, nobody really had a close connection to him but us, so... To them, it was just some rando. Still sad, though. Still depressing. Since we... Also, what is the point of this TV over here? Jesus, that... Good luck trying to get an input into that. Anyways, just, Since the last two episodes have been pretty long, I'm gonna end this one off. It, it's more right around time, but... Anyways, next time on Persona 3 Reload be continuing getting over our gaki. Rest, e uh, rest easy, buddy. You are a really good chef and a really good teacher, apparently. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care. <laughs>